Hey, what is up everyone? I'm Starlord and today I'm gonna be showing you a pretty cool Dark Souls Easter egg in the new Nuka World DLC. Okay, so getting straight into this guide guys, we need to go outside of the Nuka World Park to this red rocket right here and I am going to be showing you it on my map in just a second. There it is there, it's called the Nuka World Red Rocket. It is just outside of Bradburton, the town which is located outside there and once we get here we're going to aim and walk towards that white structure in the background. I think it's a water tank actually so yeah, we're going to walk straight down and eventually we will see a couple of houses. There's one to the left right there and it should be broken down. We just want to head right in and you should see a Jangles the Moon Monkey just sitting there next to a skeleton very patiently. If you just turn to your right, you will see there is right there the coiled sword in the ashes and it says next to it you can actually kindle the fire and if you just press A or X to actually activate it, it actually goes on fire and it looks pretty cool and obviously this is the reference to Dark Souls in which you kind of use it to teleport I believe. I'm not a big Dark Souls fan but I do plan on playing it in the future just so you guys can see me rage the fuck out at it. But as you saw, when we did kindle the fire, we actually saw three stim packs drop down from pretty much nowhere actually. So, you know with the whole teleporting thing in Dark Souls, I'm assuming that maybe it's kind of one of those like, oh somebody's teleported three stim packs to you, I don't know. It's just kind of cool to speculate on that part. But yeah guys, that is pretty much this little easter egg. And I did decide to actually pick it up to see what happens, maybe use a different kind of sword. And once I did, it was kind of just the same thing, three more stim packs dropped down from the roof and yeah, if you guys are looking for stim packs then I guess this isn't a pretty bad easter egg for you. And uh, yeah, just to let all of you guys know that this weapon in general does not have any different kind of special stats, nor does it do any more damage than a normal Chinese officer sword, so yeah, it's just kind of a cool easter egg and that's it. But thank you all for watching guys, I do hope you enjoyed this video, make sure that you go and check out all my other Fallout 4 Nuka World guides, and until next time, I've been Star Lord. I'll see ya! And today I'm going to be showing you where to find all of the hidden copy clues around the new Nuka World DLC. Now of course these are tied in